All right, everyone. So I went to the Dollar Tree and I thought I got a couple things that were really unusual. I thought it would be nice to share it with all of you and see if you guys seen this at your Dollar Tree. Now I go to the Dollar Tree to get most of my essential items. Like if there's things that I need, I will go to the Dollar Tree and get them. You know, things like cleaning supplies and stuff like that. Well, let me show you what I got. So this brings me back to my childhood. My dad had these when he would wash the car. These are the chamois and they work really great. So I got two of them and I'm going to cut them in half. Every once in a while I have a spill on the floor or something like that and it's kind of a mess to clean up. And then I spotted these. Now I know most Dollar Trees have these, but I don't think I ever bought them before. And I thought it'd be great to have them to clean up spills. So we got two of the chamois. And then I got something that really is cheap. Now, if those of you who make your salves and your own lotions or lip gloss or things like that, these are really cheap because they're a quarter each. So I use these for in the fall when I make all of my ointments and all of my different salves, which you have seen many videos of me doing that. But I got these now because oftentimes they're sold out. So I got two of these. Just I was just rearranging my camera and I saw this and I want to see how it looks. Isn't that that is a ray of sunlight. That is absolutely amazing. <laughs> so when I edit this, I'm gonna go ahead and see if it shows up. I mean, in my camera, that looks absolutely amazing. <laughs> so I don't know. That is crazy. That is absolutely crazy. I kind of like it. It's like a ray of sun. Oh, it's like a ray of sun. That is neat. Okay, I'm sorry everybody. Those of you who are watching my Dollar Tree haul, I'm sorry, this was very distracting. Very, very, very distracting. <laughs> All right, let's see if I can move it over more. Um, <clears throat> All right, so we'll do it like that. And then I got something that was really unusual and coconut infused bath cloth <laughs> wait yeah coconut infused exfoliating bath cloth i'm going to use this for something else i'm not going to use this for in the bath but have you ever seen anything like it oh my word it smells amazing ah uh, people this is strange i love it <laughs> and i'm not sure why so I think I could use this for, couldn't I use this to strain herbs? Oh my word, I wanna like have you smell it. It smells, it smells like the beach. Oh my word, that smells good. I never saw anything like that. Exfoliating coconut infused bath cloth. Exfoliating bath cloth. Okay, so I guess you'd like rub your arms and face with it. I don't know, but I would get another one of them if I'd see more. These are to replace damp red. Now, let me tell you, they work really good. And for $1, damp reds are really expensive and they work good. My husband had it in his closet on his side of the room and actually it was full of water. So we got another one. And the lady, and the lady at the Dollar Tree said that they're always getting sold out of them. All right, so I got that. I spent ten dollars now I'll show you what else I got I love getting these when they have them this is something they don't always have either and this is the two gallon bags with produce coming in a lot of people have asked me what all I'm growing in my garden well, I have a lot of stuff it's not just herbs so I have tomatoes and peppers and potatoes I have carrots I have tomatoes did I say tomatoes <laughs> I did I have carrots green beans cucumbers I have the traditional things that's in everybody's garden <laughs> so I like to have these because they're big and you can hold a lot in them and then I got my tortilla shells I use these to make tortillas but if you've seen in previous videos I love making egg breakfast burritos I make them every year and I make a whole bunch of them and I have a lot of videos on that and so I want to be making more of them because my 
daughters and my granddaughters live really close to me and then our son comes up once a week. A lot of you have noticed that he's in videos. He comes up once a week. He lives about 40 minutes away now. But he comes up once a week and he just helps me and my husband if we have something extra we want done. And then I have breakfast burritos. I can just pull out of the freezer and we can have we can have a great breakfast that way. So I want to make some more of that. And then when we were gone, we stopped at the thrift store. And I just got a dollar worth of items, but I thought it'd be fun to share it with you. Okay, so I'm really enjoying this. I'm really enjoying these. I got a couple of them and it's self-explanatory. I paid 60 cents for this, but I love them. I put them with my herbs and the baskets. I wash them off and I just love them. I, some of them have a spout on them. I don't know, I'm just really into that right now. I don't know. And I got all of these and they were half off. So I paid 25 cents for these. So I actually spend almost $2. So I spent $2. But they were 25 cents each. And I bet you're wondering, what am I going to do with these? Once again, I'm going to put them in my half gallon jugs, jars, where I have my herbs in. And I can just scoop out some when I'm cooking. I, I don't know. I don't know what people would use them for, but. I thought they were cute and they were half off and I got a perfect idea for them. Oh, and last but not least, as you know, I buy these all the time. This was 15 cents and I get a lot of these. I don't think most people are interested in it, but it is wax to put your candle wick. So you can put your candle wick when you're making your votive and for 15 cents, I throw it with my candles, all of my candle making supplies. So everyone, I hope you enjoyed this video on my Dollar Tree haul. I hope you weren't too distracted by the beam of light that's just shining upon me today. <laughs> and maybe when I go ahead and I render this video, it won't even show up. I just thought it was absolutely unique. Hmm, a beam of light and a rose. I like to think it's my mom and dad from heaven looking down upon me. <laughs> Take care everyone and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye everybody. Hey, if you like videos like these, take a look. Take a look at all these other videos I have sharing with you my life here on the homestead.